with self-belief for days. Here is the notorious Conor McGregor, simultaneous two-division champion in the UFC. Nobody has done that before. Probably the best left hand in the game, whether you're a featherweight or a welterweight, you do not want to get hit with that left from the notorious Conor McGregor. Conor McGregor has that it factor, along with a fantastic and creative striking game, a very good ground game, and extreme confidence in himself. All these make for a fan favorite combination. So here is a pro dating to 2003. Here is the consummate veteran, Jorge Gamebred Masvidal, arguably the greatest mixed martial arts athlete the state of Florida has ever produced. Longtime staple of the American top team in Coconut Creek, Florida. He's got heart, the toughness to go with it, cardio, an outstanding jab, and a submission game to go with it. This is one of the more well-rounded welterweights in the world, and as such, he has vaulted into title contention. This guy has ridiculous hand speed. If this fight comes to a striking exchange, he will have a distinct advantage. Our tale of the tape for this, our main event of the evening. Masvidal is four years the elder. He is two inches taller. The reach is identical. We go inside the octagon. Here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon, Dan Mergliata. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the sold-out Madison Square Garden Arena in New York City, it's time! Five rounds in the UFC welterweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a kickboxer, holding a professional record of 21 wins, four losses. He stands five feet nine inches tall, weighing in at 170 pounds, fighting out of Dublin Island, the notorious Potter McGregor. And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a boxer, holding a professional record of 32 wins, 13 losses. He stands 5 feet 11 inches tall, weighing in at 170 pounds. Fighting out of Miami, Florida, Jorge Game Red Masvidal. All right, get the rules in the locker room. I want you to obey my commands at all times, protect yourself at all times. I want a nice, clean, safe fight. Touch gloves, go back to your corners, come out fighting. All right, here we go. I am fired up for this fight. It's been a long time coming, and they're finally going to get after ready? it. You ready? Let's we are ready to go with round one here. And how about the buzz in this arena and just the sheer volume from these fans as Conor McGregor makes his return here tonight. Now, how will he approach the early portions of this fight? That is the big question. We know he's had some quick finishes in his UFC career, but a lot of people think he'll want to feel this thing out and get his feet under him early. Nice punch there by Gabriel. McGregor with a vicious body kick. Joe, how does he approach this particular challenge tonight? Conor McGregor has a very diverse striking arsenal. He has very good kicking technique. Oh, effective strike there by Jorge Gamebred Masvidal. Trying to establish that jab once again. That one hurt. 
Well, not wasting any time working on chewing up that lead leg as he lands his first leg kick of the fight. And he's looking for that left. Masvidal gets caught with that punch. He'd be wise to get those hands up. Oh, beautiful, beautiful kick to the body. And he connects with the punch there. Game break gets caught by the inside leg. Well, we told you about that hook. There it is. Well, he left his head open there, Joe, and he got cracked with that jab. He was almost moving into it. So let's see if he can switch up the footwork here, Joe, and make the requisite adjustments. Oh, so an interesting decision there as he decides to stand up and relinquish the dominant position. Left kick to the body. Look at this. Oh, my goodness. He tagged him. Rocked him with that right hand. Just over three minutes now to go. Conor McGregor gets caught with that punch. Not the easiest guy in the world to hit, but he got caught there. Nice job to avoid the clinch. It's a good punch. Look at the Saint with that punch. Nice shot. Throwing that jab, no good. The punch coming, it's blocked. Good punch. He is all about that left kick to the body. Oh! Beautiful kick to the body. Big straight punch. Really so oh, he's hurt. This could be it. Big shots. Just over two minutes to go in what has been a furious round one. There's a nice inside leg kick. Oh, what a leg kick. Masvidal has been nearly impossible to put away by knockout in his career. Tags Hard him. shots landing on both sides here. Leg kick checked by Gamebrick. McGregor gets caught with... Oh! He's in big, big, big trouble. Oh, he might be out. Oh, straight right. Try to establish that jab. Well, his opponent's got the read now, Joe, as he lands the punch to the head. He's got to change up his striking pattern and the tempo, or he's going to continue to be vulnerable to that count. Push kick there to the body. Good body work with that hook by Gamebrick. Oh! This could be it right here. Oh, he might wow. be out. Whoa! That's it. He's out. That he's out. Wow. To do that to such a durable guy and to do it with such composure, the way he recognized he had him hurt, relaxed, kept his rhythm, and just dropped bombs, and then boom. Yeah, Joe, safe to say he wasn't stalling or looking for a referee stand-up. He was looking to pound his opponent's head through the canvas and he nearly did so with some of those hammer fists man he wasn't trying to score he was trying to put an exclamation point on a most dominant performance here tonight and he certainly did that as he ends the fight by knocking well hard to perform much better than he did tonight a huge knockout under the lights They'll be talking about that one for some time. And here we go inside the Ladies octagon. Bruce Buffer has, has the official decision. This contest at four minutes, 13 seconds of the very first round. Declaring the winner by knockout, the notorious Connor McGregor. So the notorious Conor McGregor gets it done yet again. There is no doubt his future is in the UFC Hall of Fame, but his present is inside this octagon and still getting the job done. Dealt this man at your own peril. It seems no matter the challenge, Conor McGregor finds a way to get the job done, and he did so again tonight. Congratulations.